it's very important to look at these off-season clips of these players coming back from injuries that we have not seen for a bit. We want to see how they've been rehabbing. We want to see how they look. We want to see where they're at on their timeline. As we get closer to the NFL season, we're in May right now, so we're only a few months away from the start of training camp and start of the NFL season, so we only got a little bit of time today. We're going to be looking at Odell Beckham Jr., more highlights, more clips of him working out. We're going to look at him and how the knee looks. We're going to look at how far he's been removed from that injury and just get a good assessment from this little bit of information. Before we dig into this, make sure you smash that subscribe button because I'm going to have all kinds of workout clips, training camp, mini camp, rookie count clips on the channel. And you don't want to miss out on your favorite rookies, players coming back from injuries, or whatever clips I might find that might interest you. I'll try to cover whatever I can find here. But here's Odell Beckham. We're going to look at these. We're going to look at these clips multiple times in a row. But here's him running. Pretty much simple little jog, catching the ball one handed, which is cool. Cool for the highlight reel here. Again, getting downfield. And here, Dropping it down, making the cuts. So we're moving laterally here, which is a good sign. We're moving with some assertiveness, which is a good sign. And that's all good and dandy. And he's with the Ravens now. Very interesting location due to where the targets go in this offense. A lot of the targets go to the tight end in this offense. There are games where 30 40% of the targets goes to Mark Andrews, leaving limited targets to the other pass catchers. But now you got Rashad Bateman coming back from injury. He's coming back from a Liz Frank. Sometimes that takes some time. So don't be surprised if he has a slow start to the season. And then Zay Flowers is a rookie here, which they drafted in the first round. A lot of upside with him. Look for him to be a deep ball specialist. But it's going to be very interesting with the year removed and out of the league, but possibly really good for Odell. Just not coming back, pushing himself giving him time to get right from that knee injury, get better, and maybe we get a better version of himself, and maybe we get something out of him. Who knows? But right now, we look at the clips, and it looks like he's on track to at least come back and compete, which is good to see. Right here on the cuts, that's good seeing him moving laterally. Right there, right, left. So you're moving both angles here. Looks like he's very assertive. He's not thinking twice about it. That's good. Again, workouts, we got to see when there's actual players on the field, pads, all that stuff. We'll get camp clips. We'll get those. And I'll have them on the channel for you to see as we get more information. I'm sure I'll have more workout clips. He's very good at posting those. This is like the second time in the last month and a half I had Odell Beckham Jr. clips. He's doing more than he did in the last set of clips. He is doing more. He is being more active in these clips, if that means something. It's not like he wasn't before. It's just we just didn't have the clips for it, and he did. It, we can only see what he shows, and this is what he showed us. And it's, it's encouraging. It's encouraging. So maybe he can come back. We're always good for a comeback story. That's always good. A guy coming back and being productive to some extent, getting back with it. That's something everybody can get in line with, a good comeback story. So Otto Beckham Jr., working out, showing some goods. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Again, don't forget to subscribe on the way out. I'm just going to have workout clips for you, clips from your favorite players, and then also my fantasy football videos as well to help you out in fantasy. I want to thank you for watching, though. Catch you on the next video.